How do I run a Ruby script in Jenkins? Here's today's starting point. I have a Jenkins LTS controller version 2.346.1. Attached to this controller, I have an agent that has Ruby installed on it. Down in the description of this video is a link to a sample repository that we're going to be using. Let's go ahead and take a look at that sample repository. We have a Jenkins file and we have a hello.rb file. Let's take a look at the hello.rb file first. All that we're going to be doing is outputting hello world. If we take a look back at our Jenkins file, we've got two stages. The first stage is to verify the version of Ruby that we have installed. And secondly, we're using Ruby to run the hello.rb file. So let's go ahead and go back over to our controller. We'll say new item. We're going to create a new item name called Ruby. We'll click on pipeline and click OK. Let me go ahead and grab the URL for this repository. We'll go down here to pipeline script from SEM. We'll change our SEM to get. We'll paste in our repository URL. We'll change our branch specifier to main because that's what the branch is on our repository. Verify that the script path is Jenkins file and click save. Let's go ahead and click on build now. And if we take a look at the output of one, we can see the version of Ruby that we have is 2.9. And when we run Ruby hello.rb, we get hello world. If you have any questions or comments, you can reach out to us on Twitter at CloudBees. If this video was helpful to you, give us a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed to CloudBees TV yet, why not? Take a moment, click on that subscribe button, and then ring that bell, and you'll be notified anytime there's new content available on CloudBees TV. Thanks for watching, and we will see you in the next video.